What's I'm the, the oracle. solution to Greece? <laughs> oracle in Greece. <laughs> uh, the solution, you know, it's very difficult because there is a man clear mandate, political mandate, uh, that was given by Greek voters. And the political mandate is, uh, okay, I'm going, to, I'm going to have like this austerity uh, struck off and then I'm going to replace it with something else. Um, the mandate to be in the euro, on the other hand, uh, is to do what others say in the spirit of community, uh, other countries. Uh, so the, uh, I mean, those, th those two mandates are quite, you know, uh, in opposition with each other. Uh, they, this is the reality. And so Greek, Greek vote and Greek landslide uh, uh, victory that was given to, uh, to Syriza means something in democratic terms. And this is what, what Alexei, Alexei Tsipras is, is fighting with. Uh, so like a two-front battle, it's very hard. Well, I guess he alleged that nuance in uh, won the battle, but uh, have yet to win the war. The battle being we have an extension, four months uh, of a bailout. But uh, what does it have to, it basically gave up every measure that it had promised its people. Yeah, that's the point. I mean, you know, democracy, we, we are so fond of democracy, we try to, to bless everybody with democracy. And then we should also respect democracy. So that's a democratic decision by Greek people, uh, uh, they cannot stand anymore their the situation. It's, for me, it's a, really a blessing that Greece in all this year haven't resorted to kind of uh, civil unrest more than what we have seen. Uh, so this, this is a desperate final move by Greek people. And so it has to be confronted, it, it has to be met with some kind of pragmatism from, Look, from European institutions. But then he says, we want the battle, not the war. They want nothing. No, they want nothing. I mean, it's, it's, so why it's, say that? I mean, it's blatantly obvious. What, what can he say? Truth. What can he say? I mean, he, he I mean, can go back and say, after, 15, after two weeks he was elected, okay, you know, I, I, yeah, you elected me on this, but I managed to get something else. Five weeks later. Right. Yeah, so, so cannot. So, so, so that's, that's the whole, you know, inconsistency of objectives. This is, this is going, this well, is going to hurt. What are the Greek people prepared to do? I mean, they've given them a political, they've given the Syriza party a, a political mandate, an economic one, you could argue. Um, and yet they're going to the bank and they're taking out all their cash because uh, of a, you know, potential fallout if uh, Greece exits the EU. You know, when, you, when, when they ask you, do you want the egg or the chicken, and then you say both, right? <laughs> so <laughs> when, Greeks say, yeah, when Greeks say, yeah, we don't want to stare it anymore, but do you want to stay in the euro, then of course. Uh, uh, the fact is, as I said before, that m most, of the, most of the things that Syriza promised are incompatible with, uh, with European membership today in the present Greek situation. So you cannot have it uh, both. So, it depends. I, I don't know what is the real spirit of Greek people, whether they voted for really a program against austerity or they still want to be in the well, Euro. Back but in war the observation. Days, people bought war bonds to support their country, <laughs> yeah. right? I mean, they, what, why not that same type of know. economic support? from the people of Greece. They're taking out deposits right now, so they're not really buying bonds. One of the banks. Yeah. Uh, Varoufakis went on Italian television mm. uh, a few hours ago saying that it, it, Italian debt's more of a concern than mm. Greek. Now, being, being a proud Italian, uh, mm. it's a bit rich to say that at this moment in time, to go on Italian TV and say that debt in Italy is a bigger issue. Well, Greek. I would not comment. Of course, debt, the, 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 the amount of outstanding debt Italian debt is, is bigger, but the capacity of Italy to uh, generate primary surpluses has been proved uh, in the, the last timing. five years. I mean, if you want a PR implosion, this is probably it. I mean, you want to just still stick with your own problems rather than mention Italy, for example. I don't think that this was, uh, that he seriously thinks this. You know, I, I, mean, I think it's very clear that Italy has the capacity to generate uh, primary surplus that Greece hasn't proven yet. Do you think the Troika? There's a chance that they will take a look at Greece's list of, you know, how how they're going to appease for this four-month bailout and reject it. I hope they will be uh, pragmatical. I'm sure that this list will not abide to any 
I mean, every, all of their hopes, all of their Troika, Troika's hopes. So it has to be a compromise once again. Uh, but you know, compromise after compromise, it's, it's weakening the position of both. Mm. Uh, and so, so let's see. Uh, if, by the way, if this is rejected, if today's list is rejected, there is going to be an extraordinary Eurogroup meeting on Tuesday, uh, which will mean the second, the second meeting in, what, four days? Yeah. Uh, and this is going to be kind of deadly. So probably there will be more pragmatism today. The list cannot, yeah. might not be disclosed, so, you know, you can have some kind of, you know, arrangement. And this is what, what probably well, is going to happen. I one of the tweets that the Varoufakis has called Wolfgang Schobel the only minister of intellectual vigor of all the ministers, <laughs> which is, uh, again, quite interesting comment to make, because well, Wolfgang Schobel holds the cards, let's face it. Yeah, well, he also car, yes, but I mean, you know, you know, this is more more complicated than this. I think that at the basis of all this, we we should not forget that there is a lack with respect to, I don't know, 30 years ago of European spirit, of, of the spirit of let's create a community and stick together. And today there is much less of this, and this reflects in, in everything we see, including Greece negotiations.